What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the UTEP versus New Mexico State. Week 8 college football matchup going down Wednesday, October 18th, 2023. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between New Mexico State and UTEP and New Mexico State. 4-3 and three on the year, 4-2-1 and one against the number after back-to-back -back wins at home, following a 27-13 win over Sam Houston State last time out. Meanwhile, UTEP coming in off a 27-14 win on the road over FIU to snap their four-game losing streak. Now let's start with New Mexico State. Um, you know, they're coming off a of back-to-back wins, but this is a New Mexico State team I've had a hard time trusting for much of the season, and I think for good reason. I mean, this is a New Mexico State team that has been inconsistent offensively in terms of putting points on the board, you know, on the road. You know, they put up 17 against Hawaii, 27 against New Mexico, uh, 17 against Liberty. The offense has been hanging on to a 58-point uh, me, 58 point performance against Western Illinois, a bad Western Illinois team, one of the worst teams in the FCS, and a 41-30 to 30 loss to UMass, of all teams. UMass, that's how bad that's gotten. Put up 34 at home against FIU, but again, they're on the road here. So look at that three-game sample size on the road. They put up just 17 points against Liberty, which is a solid defense. 27 against New Mexico, eh. but the one the one game that stands out to me is the 17 points they put up against Hawaii, a Hawaii team that's not necessarily known for playing strong defense. Now, maybe you give New Mexico State a pass because that Hawaii game was the final game of, of a three-game road trip. They were on the road for three straight weeks. They went from New Mexico all the way out to the islands to take on Hawaii there. Must have been exhausted, so maybe that's where you give them a pass, but still... I, I don't expect there to be a ton of scoring here from New Mexico State. I mean, it's a team that's in the top 40 in the country in terms of rush rate. You know, they run the ball fairly efficiently, and that's the area where you can really attack this UTEP defense as they're 112th in rush defense. Um, but to me, that just says that there's going to be a lot of running the football and a lot of chewing up of the clock. So not a ton of points being scored from New Mexico State there. On the other side, UTEP's offense has been okay, but it hasn't been great. And, you know... The uh, UTEP Miners, not a team that's built to exploit the area that you can ex uh, take advantage of this this uh, New Mexico State defense, which is through the air. New Mexico State, 106th in pass defense, but uh, UTEP, the 98th ranked pass offense in the country. So I think this is just going to be a, a slugfest, a game that's a lot of mucking around between the 20s. And think about UTEP. Yes, they play the tougher schedule against teams like UNLV, Arizona, Northwestern, uh, Jacksonville State, but they've also scored 14 points or less in four of their seven games so far this season. I think this is just going to be a low-scoring battle here. I'm going to go with the under 48 because you look at the two head-to-head -head meetings, both since uh, you know these two teams, you know, the last couple of years since they sort of got back together playing every year again after they took a break in 2020. We've seen 33 points in each of the last two meetings, 20-13 to 13 last year in favor of UTEP and 30-3 uh, to three in favor of UTEP the year before. So I'm going to go with the under 48 points here. That's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here at Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.